Golden Valley Mayor Shep Harris is overseeing his final full meeting of the City Council. He sat down with us to discuss some of the highs and lows of his 12-year career as mayor. I'm feeling really good. I'm feeling uh, I'm in a good place. After more than a decade as Golden Valley's top elected official, Shep Harris feels good about the job he's done. I feel like uh, a lot has been accomplished over 12 years and the, the city is in a good position. This is a good pivot point. He came into his final term as mayor with a specific goal in mind. What was really motivating me was a uh, number of residents who wanted to see changes in the area of racial justice. But after years of fighting, he's ready to move on. There has been a, a small but vocal backlash on some of the racial justice changes and improvements that we've wanted to make. Uh, and that was uh, hard. It was not easy. I would say that honestly wore me down quite a bit. We have some goals. His recent years as mayor were sometimes controversial. Issues related to policing and diversity were often in the forefront. He's at times been an outspoken critic of the police department. In March 2022, he read a statement accusing the police of having a, quote, toxic culture of racism. I do think often of how that could have been done differently, um, but at the same time, how to honor the voices of people that were coming forward who were seeing some pretty awful things. He's not sure a different approach would have had a different outcome. I think the changes that we've made still needed to happen. Um, the question is just could um, the, the route that we took be done differently? Um, would we have still run into some of these controversies? I think we would have. But even with the controversy, Harris feels the police department is in good shape moving forward. I have a lot of confidence in the police leadership and the people that they're hiring. I think the challenge now is uh, continuing to be persistent on these goals. Meanwhile, Harris looked back fondly on the other decisions the council made. We have increased some of our housing diversity. We have passed um, regulations that better protect our kids when it comes to tobacco. But it's not only the policy decisions that Harris will miss as he leaves office. One of the things that I'll miss the most is how this um, job has allowed me to create friendships and relationships and learn that we have some really amazing residents who do amazing things on a daily basis. And even if he moves away from Golden Valley at some point in the future. This will always be home. We'll always have some sort of footprint here. Rosalind Harmon was elected to serve as Golden Valley's next mayor. She'll be sworn in on January 2nd. In Golden Valley, Kevin Miller, CCX News. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.